Her admits her role in the beating death of her young child, Rebecca Kinner, was accused of allowing her boyfriend to abuse her two-year-old daughter, Kinsley. Local 12 News reporter Larry Davis shows us how two fathers had different views on the plea. Rebecca Kinner decided not to go through a trial, and she pleaded guilty to all charges. Afterwards, her father said that she was a good mother. But Kinsley's father says he cannot wait for Rebecca to be punished. As Rebecca Kinner made her way into court, Scott Sinneth stared at her from the front row. Kinner was to plead guilty for her role in the beating death of their daughter, Kinsley. As Assistant Prosecutor Kelly highly read the statement of facts, Kenner wiped away tears. To wit, Rebecca A. Kenner did recklessly permit Bradley Dean Young to repeatedly strike her daughter, two-year-old Kinsley Kenner, date of birth 10-2-2013, about her head and body and shake her, causing serious physical harm to Kinsley, including contusions across her head and body, subdural hemorrhage, cerebral edema and diffused bilateral retinal hemorrhages, which ultimately resulted in her death. Prosecutors say Kenner permitted Kinsley to be abused by her boyfriend, Bradley Young, seen here in an earlier court appearance. He is charged with the child's murder. Outside of court today, Kinsley's father was pleased with the plea, but would like a tougher punishment. Being that honest, I, uh, I will always stay so out of death penalty. Being honest, I would. I'd, I'd vote for it right now, and I know a billion other people around the world that would vote for her to get the death penalty. Fully aware of the public perception of his daughter, Douglas Kenner says Rebecca loved Kinsley. He says the little girl was not the only one abused by Bradley Young. I think he was threatening her. I recently found out that he was beating on Rebecca, and I think she just became afraid. In Hamilton, Larry Davis, Local 12 News. Rebecca Kenner could get up to 25 years in prison when sentenced in May.